Stop watching this video, go to Bywall and buy this gun now. Hey guys, welcome back. This week, something a little bit special. Um, popped in the gun room a couple of weeks back, saw this on the wall, spotted it as something a bit unusual, and thought, you guys are like this. We have a Parazzi MX4. Um, only made for a short time in the 80s. Um, a set of a sister gun to the MX8, um, and based off the same action, um, but with just such an elegant simplicity to it, it is an absolute thing of beauty. Um, it is a trap gun. This particular one um, has the full length mid rib, um, heavyweight barrels. Um, it is tightly choked, it's three quarter and half with, a, sorry, uh, three quarter and full with a trap fore end, um, but only 29, 29 and a half inch barrels, meaning that despite the heaviness at the front end, it actually retains a sort of a nimbleness that makes it pretty much ideal. I mean, I've been shooting sporting targets with it, and I've not missed much. Let's do the oily bits and then I'll talk to you about my shooting impressions with this thing. So this is a 1987 gun. Uh, we've got, as I said, three quarter and full, uh, 29 and a half inch barrels, full length ventilated mid rib. Uh, this uh, looks like 11 or 12 mil um, full length top rib ventilated with a red front bead. We've got, um, it looks like standard grade wood, um, but it's a nice bit of timber on it. Um, trap forend, obviously hand cut checkering. The action is effectively an MX-8. Um, so you get the detachable leaf spring triggers, um, safety, but no barrel selector. Um, it's, a, it's a boss action. It, 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 it looks and handles like an MX-8, but with just no embellishment at all on the um, action fences. And I think it's absolutely gorgeous. It's deeply blued, beautifully struck off barrels, um, and just polished with some very, very light embellishment here on the trunnions and on the top, just in front of the top lever. It's just such a nice, nice thing. It's just, mm, I really, really dig this kind of understated look. Um, the Coming back to the, the grip, there's no palm swell to speak of. Um, it's almost ambidextrous. Um, not a huge amount of cast. Um, the 14 and a half inch length of pull, and we've got what, uh, it's a quarter inch pad there, so it's plenty of recoil absorption. Um, it is quite high in the comb. Um, it's definitely a trap gun, but you could have some of that taken off if you wanted to make a bit more of a sporter. Um, that said, I shoot well with a gun with a high rib, oh, sorry, with a, with a high comb, and I've snotted everything I've pointed this at. Took it out on Wednesday night uh, to shoot sporting with it, and 48 out of 50, and, and then I shot a line of DTL with it, 25, 75, just couldn't miss with it. The trigger pulls are crisp as you like. The gun's in absolutely spotless condition. I mean, it's been very well looked after. It shows signs of wear. It's obviously been used, but it's not been used hard. Um, lock up still nice and tight. Um, trigger pulls are great. Handling's just glorious. Um, recoil absorption's great. It would make a fantastic trap gun, or if you wanted to open it up a touch, it would make a great sporter. Or you could leave it nice and tight. I've shot well with it with uh, with the tight chokes in and just snotted everything I've pointed out, as I said. Um, I don't think this is going to be on the wall at Bible for very long. Um, I would get down here and uh, get a look at it if I were you. Um, I'm really struggling to not buy it myself, even though I don't need it. But um, it is such a, a pretty, tasty thing. Um, I can't guarantee that it won't be in my cabinet if you don't get here soon. So um, do get down here. I won't tell you what it's on the wall for. Find out. Ring the shop and find out. And I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. We're talking a Parazzi here for yield its money. It is, it's lovely. All right, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this. Um, just something a little bit unusual. I hope to get more guns soon. I've got feelers out for some new stuff, but I've been having real difficulty getting guns. Obviously Brexit, it's making things very difficult to get guns into the country. Um, but I am doing my best, so apologies. Um, do please like, subscribe, comment, etc. if you enjoy the show. And please, um, obviously, follow me on Instagram, Facebook, blah, 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 the usual. The channel is, as ever, supported by Bible Shooting Ground, Hull Cartridge, and Mac Wet Gloves. Guys, thanks very much for tuning in, and I will see you next time.